The Battle of the 25 of Abu of 309 BC in an unknown location between Babylon and Susa, was the decisive and final clash of the Babylonian War. It ended in a Seleucid victory, and the establishment of the Seleucid Kingdom. Chapter 1 Background Seleucus had retaken Babylon, sometime between 312 to 311 BC he had been the province's satrap before, but was forced to leave, fearing Antigonus increasing power and cruelty. The Antigonids made several attempts to retake the gateway to the rich eastern satrapies, but ended in failure. Antigonus made peace with the other Diadochi and marched to Babylon with an army of 75,000 according to some sources, Seleucus then decided to wage a guerrilla war, but Antigonus responded by pillaging and raising the territory, finally forcing Seleucus to face him on open ground, with a significantly smaller force. Chapter 2 – The Battle When the two armies met they fought an inconclusive engagement, both retired to their camps for the night, but whereas Antigonus's army disarmed and went to sleep, Seleucus ordered his men to dine and rest in full armor and in their ranks. The next morning, as the sun rose from the backs of the already deployed Seleucid phalanx, they began their advance and caught the enemy by surprise, overwhelming the enemy and routing his army. Antigonus managed to escape and gave up on the idea of reconquering the upper satrapies leaving the east, to Seleucus. Chapter 3 – The Sources BCHB 3 – Livius www.livius.org Retrieved 28 November 2019 Diadochi 6 – The Babylonian War, Livius www.livius.org Retrieved 28 November 2019 Antigonus the One-Eyed, Greatest of the Successors by Jeff Champions Weekly, Pat Antigonus Monophthalmus in Babylonia, 310-308 b. c. Journal of Near Eastern Studies. 61, 39-47. DUI, 10.1086-468,977. ISSN 0022-2968. Richard A. Billows, Antigonos the One-Eyed and the Creation of the Hellenistic State. 